I take great pride. As a machinist, you have to machine parts to be perfect. Accuracy is key to whatever we machine. It goes above and beyond pride, but it, it, you know, these parts, they need to be machined perfectly. These, uh, human hair is 3 thousandths of an inch, and we're machining things to one-tenth of a thousandth of an inch, which is like 30 times the size of a human hair. Making something out of nothing, I mean, that's, that's the key to machining, is being able to make something. It's, it's kind of artistic in a way. Honestly, I like creating something out of hot metal, like that's so silly. And growing up, I never would have thought that that would be something that I would enjoy doing. Anything, getting my hands dirty like that, or any, anything that they would consider a man's work, I guess. I definitely like cutting metal and, and the smell of it and the way the machines sound when they're rotating cutters and pieces and I just, I like all of it. I mean, you do put a lot of yourself in each part that we make, I mean we all do, and you can take days to make something or minutes, but either way you've given the ship something of yourself. That's what makes it amazing. <laughs> Like kid Christmas, you're kind of like, oh man. <laughs> just like to me, I, I get a bright feeling. Cause it's just like, like I'm saying, you know, this part is gonna go to something, help somebody out, or run a piece of machinery. This is like each machine, as you'll see, like there's some people that are wanting to like they'll put into everything, and they won't let a piece of part go out unless it's perfect, looks good. So when you look at a part that's made by a machinist, it's definitely a part of it. It shows like, what their strengths are, weaknesses are, and all that. If there's something I can't do as far as that part, I'm gonna work hard enough to make sure that I can do it, and I won't stop until I get it perfect. So I'd say that I definitely take pride in being perfect. Turning and burning. <laughs> We're working, we're turning and burning. <laughs>